there has a paradigm shift in traditional interlogistics into something new, which is called digital interlogistics. Digital data processing on fully raw computer have replaced a pen and a paper. Efficiency, precise operation, and uh, error-free systems are the key elements of modern digital interlogistics. These days, in diverse industries such as automobile, warehousing, and the port operations. At the Vantage Dealer MTC6 rock vehicle mount terminal has three different front touch panel sizes such as 10, 12, and 15 inches. So you can see there's the MTC6 15 inches terminal here, and this is mainly for the port uh, operation, which is operating with the container track system. So these three different screen size gives customer more option with their own specific applications. MTC6 addresses for a market for a fully rocked terminal by providing features such as the first sunlight readable option. MTC6 uses a circular polarizer to reduce the reflection rate less than 1%. Circular polarizer technology is totally different from traditional technologies that increase backlighting to enhance viewing, which results in the backlight getting hotter due to more power demand placed on it. Heat is one of the major concerns to, to the computer because overheating can shorten component life cycles or cause unstable operations. Second feature, highly resistant display unit, MTC6 use the industrial grade front panel which is able to operate in the working temperature range between minus 30 degrees Celsius to plus 50 degrees Celsius. The best glass of the touch display has also been enhanced using a thermal strengthening process to enhance flexibility and uh, the thickness of glass is 1.6 millimeter which is twice as thick as that of a regular touch display. MTC6 supports Windows Embedded and the Linux operating system. So we have the capability to customize the OS to fit customers' specific requirement, a service which sets ADLOG apart from other competitors in the industry. WLAN ABGN uh, dual band with the diversity antenna support. So the Wi-Fi is a really critical key feature for the vehicle, vehicle mount terminal. And the, the old data transmission is relying on this uh, Wi-Fi connection. So the vehicle mount terminal cannot do anything without the Wi-Fi connection. The Wi-Fi core is embedded into MTC6 with firmware and the drivers to efficiently manage roaming algorithms such as ROM trigger, ROM delta and the ROM period. This advanced features benefit the end customer by delivering a stable wireless connection during daily operation. CFAST storage cord with the optional capacity 4 gigabyte, 8 gigabyte, 16 gigabyte and 32 gigabyte. So the CFAST cord is the second generation of the CF card which the data access rate is about 300 megabit per second. So we are using the Swiss bit C fast call storage and uh, they perform a test with 1000 times rewrite with unexpected pow uh, power cutoff and they prove that the storage card is able to survive without data loss during the power cutoff. So if you are using the Windows non embedded operating system then this will be the advantage for customer to prevent the data loss as well. I/O includes two USB ports, one R232 COM port and the one LAN port, and another U service USB port is beneath the ray cap. Two USB ports and the one COM port are located in the back of the MTC6 in a normal configuration. The other USB port is beneath the ray cap which is designed to allow easy access to IT personnel. You can imagine the difficulty in trying to open the back cover of the unit 
after it has been attached and securely wired to a forklift truck. The working temperature range is between minus 32 plus 50 degrees Celsius. And uh, the minus 30 degrees Celsius is quite capable to apply into the coaching warehousing as well. The working temperature design applies to every single part and is a factor in material selection and the component choice. In addition, the housing is built with a sealed design important for terminals moving around in very working temperature, range of minus 30 degrees to plus 50 degrees Celsius, where otherwise condensation and the moisture could damage the components. According to the current research study, the challenge of the shock vibration on the off-road vehicle is about five to times greater than on-road vehicle. And the main reason is about the solid rubber and the mechanical design of the forklift truck. There are some key factors regarding the huge impact of shock and the vibration, such as solid rubber tires on the forklift truck, shock vibration directs feedback to terminals without a suspension system, bumpy ground. So what's the solution to prevent the failure and the malfunction from the shock and the vibration? The answer is 5 and 3, designed to withstand the impact. In the industrial field, most users know the significance of the MIL 810F standard, and the standard has been adapted for equipment usage in house environment. So why doesn't MTC6 design just follow the MIL 810F standard and why? or on the resources being spent to develop the higher 5M3. The reason is ADDOC has been contributing its expertise to the inter-logistics field for almost 27 years and accumulating experience and feedback from system integrators and end users. If one listens to customers carefully, they will likely hear about such issues as broken or malfunctioning terminals the result of shock and the vibration damage. For this reason, ADLOG has chosen to follow the 5M3 shock vibration standard, which has protection that is three times higher than the MIL 810F. We have the confidence to believe the MTC6 is quite capable of surviving in harsh environments. IP66 and the 16.7. MTC6 achieves IP66 and 16.7 throughout its internal mechanical design concept. MTC6 is subjected to IP testing by a professional third party in the Germany who holds the certification. ADLOG specific power module. It's a physical and electrical or separate to isolate the power interference between the power module and the main board. The advantage of electrical isolation is that it protects components on the main board so they are not burned out by power noise. Second, the design includes prevention of a power supply burning out from an accidental short circuit. Third, the design also includes an operation proof feature to keep the power module running during a certain period of time. The reason is electrical components need to be charged and discharged over a certain period of time to keep up the life cycle and the characteristics. Fourth, inverse polarity protection and the in rush current suppression built into the design protects the power module if the input power has the wrong polarity. The ideal power supply module is indeed very robust and the calculated life cycle is around 10 years average. The failure rate is below 0.5%. All the features of MTC6 have been mentioned are part of its proposition, which include a logistic data processing terminal, and uh, the second one is value-based design. The third one is fit seamlessly into IT environment, and uh, the fourth one is the easy to attach with the range of the vehicles. So thank you for watching the MTC6 product introduction and uh, see you soon.